or you've been around, but how do you get yourself physically and mentally prepared for what you guys are going to have to go through here this next month? Well, like, like not only you said, it's a physical and mental game, so it starts <laughs> mentally, preparing yourself daily. But the weeks before is the most important thing. We get a small break, then we come back, and we get another small break. So it's what you're doing in those off days to get your body right, to come back and finish football camp and get ready for the season. What's impressed you about how this team has come together during the offseason getting ready for camp? Uh, just the camaraderie, the camaraderie towards each other. Everybody in this building loves each other. We're brothers from the coaches to every part of the staff. We just, we have to connect on every single level so as to us to complete at the national championship this season. Health wise, kind of where are you at right now and, and what did you do over the offseason when maybe you were limited to try to get better? Yeah, I, I do feel like I was, I was a little bit limited, of course, due to small injury from last season, but I'm way better than I was in my past and I feel like working Working with this team right here, I got especially in the athletic department. They look out for me every day and give me everything I need so I can get back on that field and be my best self. What's the significance of the four starting offensive linemen back to, to kind of help Nico out as he steps into first full-time starting role? Uh, I mean, that's a big significance. It plays a big role in his and in, in his process of what he goes through as a quarterback, and it helps us a lot knowing that we can actually give him the protection he needs as a young guy, so we can get through what we need to get to. You can see from Lance, um, you know, during spring, as he kind of steps in and tries to get used to the tempo and the offense and all that. Uh, he's a fast learner. He's a big guy. Like I said, uh, kind of younger than me, coming from LSU, but he fits right into everything perfectly. He's a great matchup for what we're trying to get done on offense. And the zookeeper, uh, that's awesome. Kind of tell me a little bit about how that tradition started and what does that say? You know, you feeding off of the energy this crowd gives you. Uh, I mean, it started with the community. Uh, uh, middle towards the end of my sophomore year going into my junior year we started beating those bigger opponents and uh, I will receive those stuffed animals from the fans and it just it, it truly hold a good place in my heart because I know that they have my support and I, I, I definitely have theirs. What's your expectation for what this team can achieve this year? National championship. What gives you confidence y'all can do that? Me being around these guys every day and knowing what we can accomplish as a team. What needs to happen during camp over the next couple of weeks to kind of get on that path of winning a national championship? We have to be together on all levels, special teams, offense, defense. No mistakes can be made. And there will be mistakes made, and that's that's what this is for. That's what fall camp is for. Fall camp into the season is to minimize the most mistakes because the team that makes the most mistakes will win. A lot of young offensive linemen that got a ton of work in the spring. Um, you know, from your vantage point, what did you see about that group collectively? Anybody stand out specifically? Every offensive lineman we brought in stands out to me. Uh, they're unique. Wherever they're from, they bring their te technique and their physicality to us, and we just try to shape it into what we want as an offense. So every freshman I've seen, every guy that Coach LBS brought in has showed their best. Tontos, do you expect to be have, have to be held back at all going into camp, or will there be days where you have to kind of be monitored, or do you expect to just be able to go play ball? I'm on a full go. I don't feel like I'm, I'm, I'm not restricted in any way. How, how much? At what point in the offseason did you feel like you got to that point? Because obviously the offseason is a big time to go improve and everybody wants to do all these things, but was, was there parts of the offseason where you were physically limited? Um, yeah, of course, but it's, it's all a mental game, man. Dealing with an injury like this and uh, having so much time off, it's all about getting back and getting better, especially for my my case because I wanted to like, come back and still be who I was, but not even that, even better. So I wouldn't say it was a point in time that I felt like I was down. Every day I pushed to make myself better than what I was.